Hi there, Sagittarius, and welcome back to Star Lord is Tarot. This is your tarot forecast for the week of November the 26th through to December the 2nd. I went ahead, shuffled the cards, laid them all out. Happy birthday to any of you celebrating birthdays this week. So let's get to your reading. First up, we have Major Arcana, the High Riffin, no, the High Priestess in the upright position, followed then by Major Arcana, the Tower in the reverse. Followed then by the Four of Cups reversed. And then we have the Hanged Man reversed. And lastly, we have the Six of Wands in the upright. I'm going to go ahead and interpret this read for you guys. First of all, Saji, for your overall energy, you have that of the High Priestess in the upright. This represents tapping into our intuition, listening to our gut feelings about something. It's representing hidden knowledge, but not so much so where somebody's purposely hiding information from you, but it is more about where there's more to the story than we actually know in a situation, and we really need to listen to our own instincts and our own gut feelings on a certain subject. So a lot of you may have to do a little bit of soul searching this week to sort of get in touch with it. I use, usually use um, meditation in order to get to, you know, that sort of instinct and that uh, intuition and that's internally in all of us. Uh, whatever methods you guys have to tap in, it looks like you will be doing so. The card is in the upright position. So very good, very nice, very healing energy too. It's really good in the upright position. Just remember that this week. Tap into your gut feeling. Go with your gut this week. <laughs> That's various. Now, coming right off the hop, we have the energies major account of the tower in the reverse position. This is much better in the reverse as opposed to upright. This is can represent a shocking situation, a, a shocking story that you hear that kind of throws you for a loop, comes out of nowhere, uh, what have you. And it can sometimes represent a catastrophe or a disaster, just sort of, whoa, just coming out of nowhere again. Um, when the card is reversed, however, this can indicate we have sidestepped a potential um, disaster or potential situation that could have gone not so well. I, I think with the High Priestess being here is that you listen to your gut, you listen to your intuition about the situation. That's why you managed to sidestep what could have been a disaster. It's like when we realize after the fact that, whoa, if I had taken that deal or, or had done that situation, the way that you know this person or these people wanted me to it would have been a complete disaster but i'm glad i made the decision that i did and it helped me to sidestep what could have been not such a good situation now it's paired up with the four of cups in the reverse position four of cups again much better energy reversed as opposed to upright when it's upright this is where we have a lot of emotional disconnect a lot of emotional apathy kind of going on but when it's in reverse this can mean that we're coming out of that emotional apathy or reconnecting with our emotions again it can sometimes represent reconnecting with friends and uh, people we get along with because this can point back to the three of cups in the upright which is a very sociable energy it's a very emotionally fulfilling energy so a lot of you if you have been feeling a little bit emotionally numb lately it could be that you see something is going on to jumpstart your emotions again <laughs> now moving on towards the weekend we have the energies of the hanged man in the reverse position the hanged man upright this is someone who's waiting on a situation waiting on a decision usually waiting on other people to in order to be able to make our decision or to move forward but when the card is reversed here, we're no longer waiting. Maybe you went through a period already of waiting on a situation or waiting on a person uh, to come around. And now you're no longer in that suspense. You're looking at, you're no longer suspended in that um, sort of waiting, hanging around, just waiting for things anymore. You're taking action now. You're returning back into the land of the living. You're, you've already made your decision. You've spent some time no doubt in the hangman upright position where you were looking at things from a different perspective waiting for things to change now i think e even if things are not changing you're you're deciding to you know probably tap into your intuition and listening to your gut and you're knowing exactly which way forward you're taking steps forward now and where are those steps leading you right to victory <laughs> because the last card you have up here is the six of wands in the upright position this is a card that represents stepping into 
a victorious situation. This could be pats on the back or work well done for prior projects that you had been working on and you've now completed and people are are very happy with your work and happy with how things have turned out. For others of you, this could be returning home. This is weekend energy. This is uh, just getting a lot of attention, people happy to see you. It's like a parade, it's like a good time. So very, very nice energy, but a great way to end the week. Um, yeah, for sure, it's very good, very progressive reading here. Sagittarius, I hope this reading helped you. If it did, please feel free to like, share, and subscribe. Otherwise, I'll see you next week, bye-bye.